Hey there, seekers of style knowledge and all that good stuff. Joe here from Style by Joe with some straight talk from a gay guy. And today I'm going to go over 11 different things that all guys should know how to do. I'm not talking about all of these you have to be a master at, but knowing how to do them just makes you more well-rounded. And number one, all guys should know how to change a tire. Granted, I understand you have triple A's. The car that you just bought comes with a service. What are you going to do if you're out somewhere and they can't get to you? What if you're going to go out somewhere and it's poor phone reception and you can't even call out? I'll tell you what, I was raised by my grandparents and the one thing that I had to do before I went and even got my permit was know how to change a tire. My grandfather said, unless you do this, you can't do that. Number two, I've talked about this before. All guys should know how to shake hands properly. I hate it when I reach out my hand to shake somebody and they don't even know what I mean to do, or they give you this kind of like dead floppy fish. All guys should know. Thumb intersects firm handshake and the up and down. No. One shake, done, pull back. You're good. Number three. All guys by now should know how to be romantic. And I'm not talking about filling the room with bouquets of flowers or sending chocolates every other day. I'm talking about being able to enunciate to the person that you care about that you care about them, that quite possibly you love them. A little bit of passion, a little bit of romance goes a long way in a relationship. Number four, all guys should know how to iron their clothing. Nothing looks worse than the new young guy coming to the office looking like he just rolled out of bed because he has no idea how to iron his shirt and his pants. And let's face it, dry cleaners are not cheap when you're first starting out. Learn how to iron your clothing. You're going to look more professional and you're going to look like you actually care. Five, all guys should know how to drive a stick car. They're getting further and further away from that. Seems that only like your high-end sports cars have that. But over in Europe and South America, most cars are stick shift. You're going somewhere, you're going to rent a car, it's not automatic. What are you going to do? Plus, I kind of think that still driving stick looks sexy. Six, all guys should know how to open a bottle of wine. You're having somebody over for a nice dinner, you're having the family open over, it's a bottle of wine that has a cork in it, and you don't know what to do really not that hard. Number seven, all guys should know how to take a good photo. Most of us have mastered the selfie. We know exactly what to do, but you should also be able to take a good photo when you're taking a photo of other people. A lot of times you're walking by, somebody says, hey, can you grab a photo of us? You want to make sure that they look just as good as you would want to look in that photo. Eight, all guys should know what good manners look like and what being polite sounds like. I, I don't know when that became unfashionable. I don't know when it be, became okay to, to not be polite and have good manners. The, the please, the thank you, the holding doors, they're getting up for people when they sit down. It's all part of looking like you might be somewhat civilized. Number nine, all guys should know how to tie a necktie. I get it. Your dad tied it for you. Your older brother tied it for you. You work at a place where it's a little bit more casual. Sooner or later, that date, that job interview, that occasion is going to come along where you need to tie that tie. Look it up online how to do it. There's tons of videos there. Number 10. All guys should be able to cook something. I'm not talking about slinging that microwave dinner in the microwave or putting some uh, hot dogs on the, on the stove. 
I'm talking about an actual meal, something that you make from scratch. It doesn't have to be gourmet and it doesn't have to be amazing, but the quickest way to somebody's heart is through their stomach. A number 11, because I found out that this is actually a thing, all guys should know how to tell time on an analog clock. Schools are getting away from it because kids don't know how to tell time. If they were taught, they would know why are the schools getting away from it? I, I don't think it's that hard. Hey folks, this has been Joe from Style by Joe with 11 things that all guys should know. Style by Joe by now, of course, is the YouTube channel that you have subscribed to and it's also my Instagram. Style You by Joe is my Facebook, my Gmail, and my Twitter. Folks, I tell you all the time, if you found these videos interesting, if you found it educational, if you learned something, please let me know. If you think I'm full of it and I don't know what I'm talking about, that would be great. Let me know because at the end of the day, I'm here to serve you guys. Folks, stay stylish, maybe make some notes and decide what you need to learn. I'll talk to you soon.